1982. Boone County, a couple years before, won the 1979 Team State Championship. So they have a tradition of winning. One of those reasons they have a tradition of winning back then is our guest here today, sir, if you would, introduce yourself. Andy Mulcahy. And Boone County? Boone County High School, 1982. You were on the 1979 team? Correct. State championship team, and also the 1982 individual as we're getting ready to watch. And also, we're joined today by your coach, sir, if you would. Bob Warnick. And you were the, the coach for the 79 team? Yes. And for, I guess, how many years was you at Boone County? Uh, 75 through 82. Okay. And uh, so we got, uh, got the state championship match. Now, how did you get into wrestling? How did you find wrestling? I had older brothers who wrestled. Mm -hmm. And I went to watch them and start playing around on the mats after practice with him. And he saw me and told me I should come out for the team. And I did. I think I was in the sixth grade when I first came up there and I started wrestling in the seventh grade. That's the way it usually goes is, you know, kids nowadays, you see them as soon as there's a break on the mat, there's a hundred kids out there and that's how, you know, the interest builds and just older brother, cousin, right. somebody, right. neighbor that they look up to out there on the mats. Right. But let's go through your 1982 bracket. Okay. First round, you're wrestling Rick Walterman from Henry Clay, and I'm not sure if that's Dave's any relation to Dave Walterman or not, a longtime referee. I would have yeah. to imagine they're related, probably. I'm sure I'm sure they'll put in the comments what they are. But it's got you winning that by a fall. Correct. The second round or the quarterfinals back then, you're wrestling Kevin Baker of Louisville Fairdale. You win that by a fall as well. Correct. So you're moving right along. Now we get to the semis and you're wrestling Jeff was it Ward weird weird and it's not spelled like you think that's why it was w-i-a-r-d from Frankfurt and it's got you overtime. going uh four to four into overtime and then winning a two zero decision in overtime Correct. now overtime then is not what overtime is now no from my understanding, you guys wrestled three one-minute periods, correct? Correct. correct. Okay, yeah. Yeah. that's what I thought. I just wanted to make sure. Yes. And it's got your record going in to the finals, 36 and 4. Does that right. sound about right? Yeah. And you're wrestling from Christian County, uh, Daryl Williams. And Daryl's record going in is 33 and 2. Now, had you wrestled Daryl before? Never. Never seen him wrestle till the finals. That's the I, several videos here today in the 80s. Some of some of the even the nineties guys we've met with, you know, you I'm not saying you guys didn't travel, but Christian County opposite the end of the state. Right. You guys up here by Cincinnati hardly ever saw anybody. No, That's just we wrestled up here and we went north into Cincinnati and wrestled. Right. Where I took a few losses. And but we never wrestled western Kentucky. And as many Kentucky. guys as I've met with from Hoptown, they stayed in Nashville. They stayed in Missouri. They said the only time they would see Kentucky guys would be their home tournament right before Christmas. Districts, region, state. Every other meet, they were gone somewhere. Right. Every about every weekend. We wrestled right. teams also in Indianapolis and in, Pennsylvania. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Now, of course, we're not going to tell you how the match plays out. We've got the video, and it said it's been a long time since you've seen it. It has. A long, yeah. what, twenty uh, years, fifteen, five? I probably watched it probably ten years after we graduated. Okay. Probably so not, what, about nineties in the early nineties. I was showing like. Uh, younger son who became a wrestler and showing him some of my matches. Well, and today we'll get to have it forever. There we go. We're going to get our TV set up, go back to uh, 1982. We'll catch you guys there. All right, we're at Louisville Atherton Gym. This is the 1982 state finals. And this is your first time in the state finals, correct? No, no. I was in the state finals as a sophomore and lost one. By a, a point took second. Okay, and I kind of led you in because like, earlier in the in the uh, seventy nine Boone County team, you kind of alluded to that. So you're you was in the finals once, right. kind of fell just a little bit short. Yep. As this is your last time wearing that Boone County Columbia Columbia blue and white, knowing this is it. Sorry. Andy uh, plays second, third, and fourth going into this match, and I told him he's either going to come in first or fifth. First, <laughs> I got you. <laughs> It's, yeah. I, I, I like that mindset. So, yeah. all right, let's go back. Let's watch this. All right. Turn up the volume just a little bit. So right out of the gate, what's your uh, 
go-to takedown? Are you a better neutral wrestler? Are you a better top-bottom wrestler? What are we looking to do here? Uh, I was a better uh, on-my-feet wrestler. Uh, there you go. Get your takedown. Uh, Referee's pointing. I love how they yeah. point. I hit him with a duck under. Mm -hmm. uh, like I say, I was five foot four, and he was like six foot, so much taller than me. So right. I knew I wouldn't be able to shoot on him because mm -hmm. he'd sprawl, be so far back. So right. I chose to do a duck under. No, I mean, it, it worked. It worked. I mean, it worked. And then the, the rest of the time trying to turn him, it was, he had long, long limbs and a long wingspan. And I mean, I couldn't get him to turn. I had him locked up in cradles and all kinds of stuff, I remember. Mm -hmm. And training my guts out trying to turn him, and I just couldn't get him to turn. That's something, so. too, about, you no, know, with good coaching, knowing the wrestlers, hey, a move that a 6 7 guy can hit is not the same move that a 5 4 guy right, can you hit. You see the difference there. Oh, yeah, he's. <laughs> Yeah, to be a 132 bat, I'd never wrestled anybody that tall. Yeah, he's tall. Now, what we got going on here? Uh, I think he might have elbowed me in the nose. Got some there. blood time going on? Yeah. I think we might get a shot of Coach here. There's Coach on the left. Yep. And assistant Coach Greg Warsham, which is the one that was not here previously okay. for our state championship. Right. He was our state championship team. Mm -hmm. yeah. So he's down. You're on top. What, what are we looking to do here? What's your... uh, what I'm always doing, I'm trying to, trying to break him down to, to turn him to his back. But, mm -hmm. but like I said, I locked him up. I remember in some cradles and some different things. Well, actually, this is not one oh, of them. Oh, oh, no, he oh, reversed oh. me there. Coach is yeah. still in his seat, so that's good. He's not up yeah. having a conniption fit. He's usually pretty patient with me. Yeah, he's tall, you can tell. And I'm sure our Christian County friends will let us know uh, about this gentleman. Yeah, he was a tough wrestler, he just like I say. Uh, and I'd like I say, I'd never seen him, didn't right. know, know anything about him until mm -hmm. like this the first time I, I, I didn't even see him watch, watch him wrestling in his matches. Um, but uh, he was a darn good wrestler. So you got, I think, for stalling on the bottom. Probably got warned. Yeah. Yep. I'm trying to get out there, and he's he's just kind of riding us, hanging on. They, yep. they kind of. Coach is out of his seat now. Yeah, he's just kind of holding me with a tight weight, holding me down, not really. Right. Doing much, but. End of the period. Coach, what are you telling him right there? <laughs> I can't remember. I think he's telling me if I win this match, I'm going to get a milkshake. <laughs> I believe that might, might have been what he was screaming at me, but no. Looks like your nose or whatever is still bothering you there. Yeah, it was it was bleeding. It just okay. We got some blood time. Elbow just wouldn't stop. Now was blood time the same then, kind of as it like was it defined as blood time or do you remember? Uh, I think it was defined as injury time. I'm okay, sure. that's yeah, yeah. It wasn't it wasn't long like it is now. They didn't yeah. give us five minutes. You went over and wiped it off, and went back on the mat. <laughs> it's like, yeah. You know, bloodborne pathogen awareness hadn't hit the exactly. mainstream yet. Not yet. Not yet. So we Rip were... some dirt on it, kid. What's wrong with you? Yeah, get him. So, that's why I said yep. like, I had this completely locked up in a cradle, but you can see he's got that back leg. It's just it's so long. He's, yeah. And I, I'm sitting here about pulling my back out trying to get him to go up. You can tell you're. I'm giving everything I get to try to get him to go up. And I, you can see right there, I, I got both feet in front, yep. cranking back, and the, you can see his leg back there. He, mm -hmm. just, he just had a. A wingspan that I could not. All right, so I think he calls a stalemate. Yeah, he did. Yeah, stalemate. That's hard to call a stalemate in a cradle. Yeah, like that. I mean, that's pinning combination, but after so long you didn't turn him, they're going to stop it, so back then. I may do that this year a couple of times to see how coaches react just to get their. Yeah. I'm kidding, guys. I'm, I'm kidding. I won't. <laughs> Because as sure as I do, somebody will play this clip. Oh, screen, he's a cheater. That's right. Hang on him. Yeah, he just, he was strong on the bottom, like you say. And like you say, trying to get anything on him, I was and, just. And you can tell, difficulty. he'd been coached well about how just to stay flat. He'd be a yeah. great freestyle wrestler. Exactly. Yeah, he was. He had a great base, a strong base. And if I'm not mistaken, I, I, I think it, he ends up actually getting out here. But. All right, out of bounds.
just that knee pad. Get that extra little second of breath. Got to get a breather. Yeah, got to get a breather. <laughs> I think that's why kids wear knee pads and stuff now, just so they can get extra breath. Wait a second, Mr. Official. My knee pad. Injury time. Now, are those Christian County map maids we're hearing? Yes. Or is that Boone County? That's that's Christian County. Okay. Yeah. I don't I, I don't know that we when we had four or five map maids. It's, they were just uh did all the stats and all for us. Yeah. They didn't actually now, cheer. Some of the old Christian County and Hoptown photos I've seen. Oh, there, there it is, near fall. Yeah. Oh, well, he didn't, he didn't, he didn't get nothing. no back points, and nope, I ended up losing it and oh, my. reversed me. Some of, the, some of the old Christian County and Hoptown back in the 80s and even the 90s, they had probably more Matt Mays than they did boys varsity cheerleaders for basketball or football. Right. There it is. Yeah. Coach, you know who these referees are by chance? No. I like to give the referees, yeah. you know, credit as well. I'm not familiar with my, my elder referee brethren. There's a few you can pick out. You can pick out Jack Klein, Tom yeah. Hardy, uh, a couple others. You can Gene, 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 Washington. Gene Washington, Sayers, Don yeah. Sayers. Trying for a switch. He steps over. Ooh. Now, when you're on bottom here, did you feel like in danger at any point? Like, uh-oh. Uh, well. Yeah, anytime you're on the bottom and somebody got you, catches your leg or something on a switch and steps mm -hmm. over on you, you're, you're endangering yourself to back points and stuff. So, yeah, I was worried. But like I say, this match went to the to the bitter end. So, right. I mean, it was a – he fought a hard match and it, it just came down to the last the last takedown. So. 1982 had some had some uh, some names. You know, you got Rob Irvin. Irvin. Um, Jeff. Uh, uh, Chaney Jane. from uh, Jane. Danville. Chaney, yep. Couple other. You know, I believe we're in the third period. Yes, right? third yeah. period. Third period. I think I'm losing. Is it four to two right now? And he was content on riding me out, so he was just he wasn't really working any takedowns, just mm -hmm. locking a big long tight waist around me and just right. holding. Now they're warning him for stalling. Yep. There you try to switch. There it is. Go, 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 go. I think I ended up. There you just push him down. Yeah, I think I only got one on this side. Yep. Yeah. So. I think it's 4 3. That's what I'm saying. I think it's 4 to 3. It's 4 3. You're down yeah. one. God, he's tall. Yeah. I think his legs are getting longer by the ma <laughs> longer the match goes. And I think uh, at this point it's getting close to the end of the match and he's trying to just back away and right. I think he gets hit with a stalling point here in a minute which ties the match up. Mm -hmm. So it was like like it is now a warning then a point? Yes. Okay. Yeah. He'd already been warned when he was on top of me riding. Right. So he'll start back pedaling a little bit here and now go hit him with a, a stall point. Yep. There it is. Good memory. So it's 4-4. Four, four. It's 4-4. Four, four. What was it about? 30 seconds left in the match, maybe 20. All not I know is that, much time. all I know is I I was tied up with him at this point, and I heard him say 21 seconds left, and that's when I threw a Japanese wizard on him and caught it and threw him and put him down. So. Right there it was, 21 seconds. Yeah. Or maybe no, that might have been 30 seconds. Yeah, okay. I just remember we're tied up and. I hear the 21 seconds. That is something too about some of these years. The the PA announcer will like actually commentate the time and score and stuff and right. kind of adds to it. 15, 15 seconds. 15. This is when I throw it right here. Oh, oh, oh. Go for it. Go hard. There it is, man. I took him to his back. And they didn't give me back points. They just gave me the takedown. But it was enough. That's all that's, I needed. Hey, that was it. Yeah. And that's a great feeling right there. Oh, it does. All the years of wrestling, and just to get that, it just, it, there's no words to say how it feels. Oh, yeah. All those years in the mat room, man. Right. Paying off, and you knew, uh, 
Yeah, 40, 41 years later, you'd be doing a review video with me on the YouTube. This thing called YouTube. <laughs> yeah, exactly. There you go, man. Jumping, coach picks you up. Yep. And all your teammates. And all my teammates. Yep. And my best friend, and partner for every year I ever wrestled. Probably the toughest match. Probably tougher than that match in the in the wrestling room. He's getting ready to come out and do his title now. Mm. So, um, so, yeah. I think I end it here. Yeah. Um, so did it play out the way that you thought it did? Kind of, well, kind of, sort of, maybe? Well, I mean, going into a match, you know, you're always hoping to win. But right. there's always, it's happened before in, in my history, getting caught with something that yep. you're not used to. And, and wrestling someone you had nothing, no background on them or any, yeah. you know, used to even seeing them wrestle. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was a tougher match for that reason than it was the guys I wrestled, you know, mm -hmm. all the time for seven years. Um, so yeah, it was it was a tough match. So wow. very Man. tough, but I was glad the way it ended. Oh yeah, it's and thanks for being here today. Right. Thanks, Coach, I, for being here. Really appreciate it. I appreciate it. it. I thank, thank you, very you much. Coach. Sure. Get you get a handshake here. Really appreciate it. And you know, thank you for I guess adding to the Boone County legacy and being able for those that come after you to say, hey, I want to be I want to be what he was. Yeah, that's what I said. I, we tried. We we tried to keep it going. So that that was and, our job. So. And like I said in other videos today, you know, maybe not now, but at one time, Dad could do it. Right. And now you've got the you've, you've got, got the, the proof. proof. I got the proof. You may have the medal or the jacket or the ring or whatever, right. but you've having it on video. Let, uh, Your Honor, I rest my case. That's right. I re I rest it right here. Right. So thank you, man, for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, if there's more Boone County guys out there, I'm still looking for the 1979 Boone County State Championship uh, year just for the Boone County team. That way I can send it out to them, let them you know, see themselves wrestle all these years later. So if you have the 1979 or any year now that I'm missing, I've been able to acquire a couple years uh, today, the 1986. I think we may be able to find a couple more years, hopefully, uh, before we get out of here today. But... Thank you guys for being here. That's all we got. We'll see you guys on the mats.